first, uh, a whole high school in New York is having remote classes today because the building was needed. Would you like to see? Yeah. To house people who came into this country illegally. So what is the president's priority in this case? Is it the migrants or is it the students? Let me just uh, just clear this up a little bit. Um, so yesterday, New York City informed us that as a precaution, what a idiot! Uh, they would temporarily relocate migrants staying at Floyd Bennett Field to a nearby high school. As of this morning, all migrants have returned to the facility at Floyd Bennett Field. I said, no, what? And so, anything specific as to the program and what decided to do, and all of the specifics to that, I would certainly refer you to New York City uh, for any additional questions. But if a <laughs> settle down, baby, working parent had to call out to stay home with their kid today, isn't this Biden immigration policy literally taking money out of people? Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! I'm gonna actually go back to your first question for a second because I think I do need to address that, which is. Um, you know, when it comes to education, migrants, the economy, the president deals with multiple nope. <laughs> issues all at once. That is his job. There are multiple things happening all at once. And as it relates to this particular question, question that you're asking me about in New York City, that is something that New York City needs to answer. For ethnic diversity, but this is just pan answers to that is a that is a process that they took, so they have to answer to that. Uh, and a, as it relates to migrants and what's happening at the border, look, the president has taken this issue very seriously. Hey.